What's up guys and girls, and uh, welcome back to Construction Simulator. I'm joined by David. Hey, hey, how's it going? Well, uh, last time... We have... We're hopefully a lot further on with this, because this one seems to be going on. We dropped containers off, and now we've got to just... We placed them, if you remember from the end, but now we've actually got to place some more down to it. Coming towards the site. Uh, I'm hoping we get this finished. So am I. We, like to... we should get this finished tonight and move on. I would like to get moved on to something else, if I'm honest. I'm I not... think it's about time. Not doing the parking garbage. No. Hey, <laughs> you've told me about that one. Yeah, not doing that one yet. I mean, we can. If we have the money, I mean, we could have... I made another job while... Well, no, 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 no. What I mean was you could either, I don't know, do something like the... You know, you've got... We can either do the airport or we can do... a dip, Go down the different contract route. It depends what, we'll the, next, have... depends what the next contract yeah. route is. See what we get offered next, yeah. On the campaign. Yeah. I think after this we just do a couple, we just do maybe like one non-campaign job or something like that. Well, you have to see what we get offered in that, because that refresh, they re, they refresh. Yeah. So that's them containers, now we've got the... Sounds like David's mess, trying to mess around with the telehealth. I'm sure me and David had the discussion that during our last... Yeah, of how not oh, good the telehandler is. Yeah. It, they're, they're not bad, but they're not... Okay, well, you're going for the rebar, are you? No, because I can't get the telehandler to work. <laughs> Basically, you need to be... You need to be fully side on with it. If no, I took me the first minute and a half not to be swinging the camera around because I was trying to use the mouse to control the arm. Yeah. But that's just my farm sim. How long you? Because I've no doubt once you've placed all them, there'll be a job to unpack them. Yeah. That's what he usually does. So I guess who, uh, I guess who joined for Skull and Bones last night? Go on. Go on. Oh, very nice. It's good to see him back in things. Obviously, he's been doing a lot with me with Dead Island 2 and stuff like that. Mm. So what's Skull and Bones like then, is it? Oh, it's good. I like it. It's... Um... Better than Sea of Thieves, or...? Have you ever played Assassin's Creed Black Flag? No. I don't want to compare it to Black Flag, but it's very sort of... light Black Flag in terms of ship-wise. Yeah. It's, it is like Sea of Thieves, except there's not much PvP. And to be honest, one... Better the... for it. Yeah. The way the... Oh, right, okay. The way that the... Oh, they got all these behind me. Yeah. The way that the ships handle are very much Black Flag. Don't like don't like comparing. Um, but in terms of how the ships behave, uh, a little, I would say, a little less in depth than yeah. Sea of Thieves. But I think better. Right. If I'm honest. What makes you say that? It's concrete pause. Then. It's the way the the cannon plays more better. Right. The. The cannon play is a lot better. The, I mean, the enemies, holy fucking shit. 
we haven't done the mi there's a mission that I did during the close beta the 15 minute battle that yeah. is on the YouTube channel we haven't done that yet with Alan we will be taking him into that um, right. and the interesting thing is the more people you have you can only have it's free per party which seems a, a bit of a strange number to have you're not all on the same ship. You each have your own ship. Right. Which is something that Sea of Thieves lacks. You know, you're each on your own ship. I suppose in Sea of Thieves you could always, I suppose, nick another ship if you wanted to. Yeah, but then you technically can't because if you try and nick somebody's ship, they'll just scuttle it and then you're, you're kind of screwed. Fair enough, yeah. So, you know, either way, they just need to scuttle the ship and then you're pretty much mm. buggered. Whereas, you know, this, you can do... You know, the, the cannon... Like, the, the cannon play is, is very good. You can change your cannons, so you can get better cannons. Right. You know, you can get, as we found out, yesterday you can apparently get torpedoes and oh, very nice. other stuff um i obviously i've still got to uh, that doesn't go on that one does it what does it <laughs> you know i've still obviously got to do the video but it doesn't go there Weirdly, for some weird reason. Must be a slide. There is two or three different lengths often, some are only a certain length. Yeah. And. It's. Obviously, Alan's got it on the Xbox because he already knows his. PC wouldn't. PC will not handle it it's a little bit smo smoother than the beta so they've done a lot of optimization work so say, you are, you're having smoothness issues god help the rest of us yeah but i have smoothness issues with games that are can be quite unoptimized i get smoothness issues with this and that is on because this game lacks a little bit of an optimization at times <laughs> but they, I mean, I can solidly run that game on Ultra at 150 frames a second. Comfortably. Fair enough. I made a comment during last night's stream, because obviously I streamed my point of view as well. Mm. I made a comment that it's perhaps, even if you were interested in that game, I maybe one that There was one point in it I was on board the wheel because you can have like first person, third person cameras when you're, yeah. you're on the ship. Now there was one point I was in first person camera and it was even making me feel a bit. Right, you said doing pretty Sea of Thieves was doing that to me. Yeah, where Sea of Thieves wasn't with me. And it's weird, it's the only game I've ever experienced that. You know a lot of that can be down to monitor refresh rate. As well. That can be an effect of it. Yeah, but it's the fact that no other game I've played... No. That did it. Has done it. I know what mm. you're saying, I don't disagree with you, but... It's weird how I've played racing games, I've played games on boats, I do everything and I've never had that issue. But well, that... there was something to do with the graphics and the colours of Sea of Thieves, as well as the, the way the character bobbed around when you walked. You could, yeah, possibly. I mean, you can turn head bobbing off. Yeah, but... it's a somewhat about it. There was but... a couple of times where it got me very close to <sighs> not feeling really well. I don't think I've actually got that far. I never got that far, but I just... I could sort of start to feel it in my head. Yeah. 
something wasn't happy. I mean, like I said, I was playing. So I say, and I, I'm, I'm not like a person who gets travel sick or anything like that. So no, I don't get, I don't get travel sick. I can get motion sickness. You see, I don't. I can. But oh, well, certainly that's the first time I've seen anything like that. But yeah, that playing. How do you find VR then? You get it and you're in VR. Or... I have not used my VR headset and I can't use my VR VR headset anymore. Unfortunately, Why? it makes me sick. All oh, right, so yeah, so that does get you then. Yeah, I anywhere that like if a roller coaster happened to turn around and offer VR, I would basically turn around and say, look, I want to ride it without the VR headset. Because it will make me motion sickness. Hmm. And yeah, if the v if, if there was a VR headset that was perfectly crystal clear, you know, was well optimized graphic wise, etc., yeah. etc. Et you know, all it would the graphics would have to be crystal clear to yeah. not affect me. But on certain like my old. PlayStation VR headset use I could only do about an hour and then I was feeling ill. Yeah. Are you doing the concrete or am I doing the concrete? You want me to do it's easier to do the crane. If you want. I'm bringing the concrete truck over. Where's the concrete actually need to go? I haven't seen. On top of the two you see the two containers? You see the where the containers are? Yeah. Basically, it's on top of there. Right, I'm just trying to work out where I need to put this thing to... Because I didn't take this away early, I was trying to move some machinery away. I noticed. Oh, we haven't finished the conquering yet. The best... Don't forget, you go got to make sure you can get the legs out there. There's loads of room here. Has the game allowed it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Easy. Okay. But no, there was one point I was in first person and I thought, oh god, if I don't, if I wasn't skin on it, I don't know how David would feel and I didn't feel, I had to quickly swap it from first person to third because mm. of the ball, and obviously you can't see my hand movements, but if you put your hand in front of you and go, like literally rock your hand left and right, that's how you yeah. could see that boat was moving. Yeah, that wasn't fun. I think I might need to move a bit closer, yeah. Unless, there must be one more level of one. Oh, yeah, there is. Now oh, that's better. Yeah. You need to lift your boom up. Had you extended your the pipe? I have now. I'm ready when you are. Okay. Boring. Likewise. And it was just like, yeah, it's good. It is good, not. Yeah, it sounds like it sounds like. Which is good because I think I think it's a genre of game which hasn't been overly explored. I mean, I know you got like Sea of Thieves now that start taking it. Yeah, but Sea of Thieves took the ground basically. Ah, basically, your trick. What? Turn Get the pipe to lie down. Are you ducks? Oh, and you're so close to reaching the far end. Actually, I'm, I'm hoping that might be close enough.
Maybe there was a height limit you could drop the concrete from. Yeah. <laughs> That's the only way the thing had gone red. So what are you up to? 46 on the ceiling. On this first one, yeah. I mean, wrong button. Job menu. Crew. Concrete, concrete, unpacking, unpacking, upper floor, upper floor, top floor. So we're basically concrete ceiling, prefabricated components. So it's basically probably going to be more containers, more ceiling, concrete ceiling, unpack bits, and the same a couple of times over. And then, yeah. then the top ones just special compound deliveries. So it's basically going to be crayon work and concrete. Seems to be the running theme of this build. Yeah. The containers and then concrete placements. And just hopefully you don't nick our... You don't nick all the fucking money again. Hey, it worked for me. I was negotiating a better pay rate than you. 10% left. Yeah, I'm hoping there's enough in these cars that have to go. So I have to go and try and do that very far, mate. I can see me having to friggin' move. You sh hopefully should have enough there. You might need to move, obviously, to get the other side, of course. I'd say I'm going to. Come on. No, you want to. Oh, you ask. Will it? Is there anywhere, any like little holes? Oh, there's a little bit over there. That you can grab. Got it. I think I'm going to move the thing to. Well, yeah. You've got to get that other side, haven't you? He jumped out yes, again, didn't he? I keep doing that, don't worry. I don't know which side you want to go with it. You got to need to leave enough space, obviously, to get your support legs out. I know. Don't worry. I'm actually surprised you let me get away with that one. Did it? Yeah. Why are you surprised? Because I've got one leg on the pad for the crate. Yeah, but as long as the machine's stable. Man, but you're really not helping me right now. Camera's done. Can you reach all the way that you need to there? Looks like here. Yeah. Okay, four. Then wondering if I do your trick. Yeah. Yeah. But I only did my trick by <coughs> fluke. Well, I've started actually wanting to make you do it now. Why am I not pouring? I don't know. I have pouring set to what? You are now. Because I'm seeing the percentage go up. Hmm. in trouble. Couldn't find my phone charger. <laughs> I mean... They'll ref... Them contracts will refresh. There's not a lot there. But... Oh. What have you done? I'm shooting it over the edge. 
some poor person walking past just got stoked. The camera doesn't help when you're working with. No, it really does. Stupid. Like. angles. You're only at 30%. Why? I think I'm having a bit of fight with some of this stuff at the moment. Are you too high? No, no, I've got a green thing. Well, if you want, I say, if you want to swap the roles... I should be able to do this one, I should. No, I don't mean now, I mean on the next bit. If you want to swap roles, you do the crew and I'll do, do the con crew. Possibly, yeah, well... So what have you been doing with Karma Camp, anyways? I just, sometimes Karma Camp to me is just a nice one just to stick a podcast on and... I mean, I was rebuilding a V8 Mercedes. Yeah. I've also got a BMW and a Dodge Hellcat in the garage at the moment. Yeah. I mean, you did all that bloody... Changing around, didn't you? With certain yeah. parking bit, which I'm not. I didn't mess. I never messed with it. It's it's quite complicated to get set up. It's not about once you've got it set up, but it's, it's, you've literally got to you've got to learn the coordinates of where you want the cars to spawn and the angles and oh, get that. Okay. It's not. I mean, I could always send you the files I'm using. Yeah. Probably the easiest way, because I say, I guess what I think, I've, I've got some like 50 summer cars sat outside. But does that keep, yeah, but does that keep car data, or is that just go on and where cars can be placed? No, it keeps the data. Basically, what it does, yeah, you, know your par you know your parking alleys? Yeah. It basically takes them, so the cars that it says are parked, they're actually coming, rather than being parked in this alleyway, it might be parked outside my garage. Yeah, but ones if you haven't got them cars. On your profile. Oh no, if I sent you the files, they would just... You'd be able to just... They would move to whichever cars you have. The, the file uh, I give you wouldn't actually say the cars, it would just say... No, but well, that's what I said. Would it be just parking data or would it be car data as well? Yeah, it'd be car data. It'd be the parking data and all the cars. Yeah. Was it what? Where's it? Was to unpack? It would. It does give you. Um, it takes about when I first load them. Every time you load into the map, it takes about a minute to load. You've got to load all those cars. Hmm. Yours will probably be down site quicker than mine. Why? But you're on SSD. Yeah, but you've got a lot more processing power than that than I have. I've got a lot more RAM, but yeah. Yeah, but RAM's never been a bottleneck for my system. How the fucking hell do I get up there? Wants us to unpack something on the roof. Oh, there we go. Found the stairway. Alright, so I'll jump in the crane. You know, like I say, um, yeah, I am. Um... I've never seen my machine use more than about 20, 21 gig. But you've obviously got a lot better I... process than I have. Yeah, right. So, Alright, so that's some more containers to go on, I guess. Yep. I have advanced their skill point, apparently. Yeah, you will have done. Oh, there's more of these. Yep. Where the fuck is it when you put them? On the roof. All oh, right. Okay. So it's basically it's yeah it's that going on there and where we've just concreted. Yeah. Okay. So I, I yeah I know what it's it's trying to do. So you basically 
stacking containers on top of containers is for <laughs> rooms. Well, with that concrete pad in between. Yeah, for rooms. Hmm. Excuse me. See, because I like, you know, I like the idea of the the way you've done it. I wish the game would. Yeah, it it makes more sense. You know, the cars part outside. Hmm. I mean, mine just look like a scrap yard, which you know, if I had the time and the money and the space, how a yard of my cars would probably look anyway. Just proves how much of a hoarder I can be. Yeah, but I bet if you do all them cars up that you've got there, I bet you'd be you're sitting on some money as well. I'm already sitting on good money because luckily one thing I did early was a Ferrari 250 GTO. Yeah. Sold for like 18 million credits. Do you know what? If it had been me, I'd have just started displaying what you'd done up and then sold them. Took a picture. I do to an extent. I do to an extent, but... There's also quite a few that have become my personal collection that don't get sold. Hmm. So the next thing it'll probably want you to do is put the roof, bit roofing bits on that. Then probably concrete on top of these. And then the concrete on top of them. So I'm guessing looking at those towers, there's going to be another two levels yet. Uh. We've got. One more after this of an upper floor and then a top floor and then that's it. That's what I'm saying, yeah, two more floors. Yeah, that means, I said looking at the height of those towers we built. Yeah, so I suggested two more. more. What was the button to turn an item again? I found, I found it. I know I must give you on controller. Yeah, exactly. Because I would have given you my control button. Okay, with hindsight, this was maybe a mistake. What, putting. Leaving this one to the last one to try and slot in between. Hmm. Camera, just try and be at least semi helpful for once in your life. Yeah. That's why I used... Oh, come on, that's that scene. Causing problems. <laughs> well, you can't be far away now. What was I going to say? Drop that on top of the other one. Put that on top of that yellow one. If you can no, get it I'll in. I'll get it in there. I'll get it in there. And I'll use the crane. I'll use the other crane and pick it up from the other side. Can the other crane pick these up? Oh, yeah, because you just load onto the truck, didn't we? Oh, no, oh, hang on. Now, why is it not accepting that? Because that couldn't get much more in if it tried. Is that the correct one? That's a yellow one. I think that one's on the other side. How was it going by colour? I was just going by the fact it was the right yeah, side. Yeah, but it goes by... The game is wanting you to go by colour. <sighs> is the... Is there a brighter marker there? Yes, there's two over here. Yeah. Now he tells me. Yeah, look at your markers. I'll mark you in a minute. So he was trying to faff around getting a one that was supposed to go on the other side, I think. I was, yeah. And then that the one... Hungry. That one can go in that gap. We'll probably go in that gap. But I have a feeling now he's going to find that gap a lot easier. It's never had to be as precise as it was there. Yeah. So if you basically put it down there, put some sort of insulation under the floor, in, or some protective cover at least. There you go. That went in much easier. That's what she said. 
There was a couple of points I could have said that was she said to you before, but I didn't. <laughs> you never thought of it. I did, I just didn't. I wasn't going to say it. Ah. Uh. So then... Well, that doesn't make sense. Why is there another yellow one there? Because there's two yellow ones on the end for some reason. That's kind of weird. It's... It's Neil Lawrence Llewellyn Bowen, it's their design, they can do what they want. I know, want. but that doesn't make sense, because then that would go off against the colour code that they had, because on that other end should have been a blue. Well. Yeah, well. Is it wages the contractors? We're not paid to think. No, we're not. That the count local council. Useless. Ah, they need an upgrade for that. Well, but who does like construction works to a road from like nine a.m. till three a.m. Uh, for nine a.m. till three p.m. each day, and shuts just this a section of road off. Councils. Yeah, well, that's what they were doing. You know, as you come out on the. Tr across the traffic lights and you go mm. straight up the hill well they've, yeah. shut, they've shut the bottom off there to to um concrete in no ceiling elements first oh, yes, it is. so they've shut that off there to, up to the end of the the turning where you could turn left as you as you come up the hill Right. Just that section of road's been shut. Because it looks like they're resurfacing it again. <laughs> Fucking useless. When other bits down the road, that as you go further down the road, need doing. Yeah, but those which won't be near a councillor's house or something like that. There is nobody that lives around near there. There's no council that lives near there anyways. I know the fact that they, there's no councillors there. Because the nearest fucking councillor I know lives up on fucking up the bank. Right. <laughs> but I know there's a fucking councillor that lives that way. And it's just, you know, it's just like, what the fuck, you've, you know, you've done that when there's worse streets. Even coming down towards the road you could take down towards my street. Towards <laughs> the co-op bit. Need resurfacing because there's fucking big bumps in it and Fucking potholes, pricks. I know you're getting yep. rid. Of... I know they're getting rid of the money before the fucking financial years out. Yeah. Yeah. But it's every single fucking year. The two years on the trot. That same section of road's been dumb. Every time. <laughs> Assholes. Makes you wonder well, where. The... Makes you wonder where the money goes within your local authority. We know where it goes into the pockets of councillors, now. Well, I'm guessing so because there's been there's been plenty of potholes that could have been uh, patched, <laughs> and it wasn't. It wasn't until somebody had to somebody put a claim in. I take you know where Bank Lane is. Yeah. Yeah, well, somebody put a claim in because a pothole up there literally destroyed their tyre and alloy. Mm. And they had to claim against. And, uh, oh, look, lo and behold. It's fixed. A couple of days... A couple of days later after that claim, pothole gets pulled. Pothole, that hole that caused the damage got filled. <laughs> You know, they can't, and it's all right, people turn around and say, well, you know, the council can't do anything unless you report the potholes. It's like, the potholes have been reported. Yeah. You just don't do fuck all about it. Until they absolutely have to. Yeah. And 
and it's it's just like why do people pay your council tax you, know? you go to prison if you don't no but the thing is <laughs> it's why do you know why do people pay the council's council tax what do we pay them the council tax for Well, those public services you don't use. What public services? Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? The joke. <laughs> that you pay. Did you like this and how's he's running for councillor, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> no, because if I do that, I've got to become a member of one of the fucking parties. They don't start your own party, but it's the independent. True. The GT UK party. <laughs> Our slogan is party. <laughs> but it's just no. It's it. It just makes you wonder where all the money goes that councils get. You know, where does it spend? There's a certain company in this town that's give a lot to the council. What the fuck have they done with all that money? Mm -hmm. Have you seen the mayor's nice new car? <laughs> no, I actually haven't seen that car for a while. Is that where we're going? <laughs> well, this is the last piece going on. It was only a fucking... What the fuck what, what was it they were driving around in last time? Fucking Jag or something? Last time I saw it, I think it was a Skoda. I don't know. I thought it was a Jag. I concrete the ceiling. I'll get the crane out of your way. Anyway, to change the subject something a little bit more interesting and light-hearted. Do you watch STH this month? No, not yet. Oh, fair enough, we won't talk about that then. It's just come out, hasn't it? Well, four days ago at the time of recording. Or have I? Let me check my YouTube history. Yeah! It's obviously really memorable if you have. Yeah, but I've watched that much stuff of... Alex is so far. Oh no, there was another there was another Hunt the Survivors come out. Oh I haven't No, I haven't finished it. Ah, fair enough. No, I haven't finished it yet. It's It's the one where he decides he's gonna do the bike strategy, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. I'm going through through it. Oh, yeah. I mean, I know he keeps trying to keep it as fresh as possible. Are you pouring? I was, but I think I, I think it slipped off. Oh, yeah, so we get it now. Yeah, yeah, as long as you go. As long as that's what it, as long as you literally. Hmm. What was I saying? I've said something. Like the hunt. Yeah. I know it's been going on a long time. I do enjoy that series. I know that he does try and. Yeah. Make it fresh at times, but is he not running out of ideas now? Hey, you've got to. Well, that's why he keeps trying the different, slightly different. Versions and all that, you know, they've done the tiers list now, and the fact they're not allowed planes until a certain point. Tier 2. Yeah. Also, when you look, because he's on next gen now, there's wildlife in him, I didn't realise that. Yeah, did you not what? Did you watch. Did you watch his Gone in 48 Men's? Yes. Did you not see. <laughs> not see where what Ladder ends up getting killed by one? Yeah. And then he meets it in the tunnel. <laughs> I am what I was going to say. Um, I think he's next, but I think he's got links with people who are doing it. 
He wants to try and do one on a 5M server. Why? Well, you'd be able to really disguise. If you were to take an NPC body, you wouldn't have like the names. You wouldn't have any other. Hmm. Do you get what I'm saying? Depends if he's a one. Depends if they would allow him to do it. Well, the thing is, he's still, well. I know this is reading, but I know he's done stuff with Ruffy who has his own 5M server. And I'm sure, because they only really use theirs for races, I'm sure they'd let him do a free roam. I just think that'd be the next logical step. Yeah, are you... Because like I say, I'm pouring into you. Okay. It would be empty, sorry, to refill it. Um, it cause like I say, you'd be able to do so much better disguises. Oh, yeah. The problem is, because they're going to know the vehicles... he's out the vehicle spawn set would be better. Yeah, I know they like using the customs, but it's whether they'd be able to do the whole pre thing and stuff like that. So. Yeah. But you don't, you can't get 5M on. I'm assuming they're doing it console. I think they're doing it on Xbox One, aren't they? They're doing it on Xbox Series. They're, yeah, they're doing it on Xbox because of the control scheme he's using. But yeah, if they were to try a PC, say a PC one, I think on a 5M server, would yeah. seriously take you up a level. Yeah. Like, you're going to have to move to the other one, aren't you? Yep. Oh, I would. It'd make it interesting. That I also get this really, I also get this really interesting thought of doing the on a, an open public 5M server. Problem is with that, he, they probably would just have too much carnage to deal with. Because once they, because a lot of people will know his tag. Mm. And yeah, but you know, the thing is, if I you can change that very easily. Because you can make it character names and stuff. You might need to go forward. Can you go forward? There you go. I think you... Yeah, could, could you imagine it? I mean, you probably couldn't do it with as many people as he normally does, but if you, like, just went to, like, a, one of, like, the police RP servers and did a survive the hunt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you'd have the extra level of also trying to avoid the police. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Would make it very interesting. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, I mean, if I'm going back to that Bruffy's G friend in an open RP lobby. Mm. Which is one of the funniest things. See, as I head on with that fire truck. Yeah. <laughs> they're trying to like do RPs, like, no, I'd want to race! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I watched that. I think, well, the G friends in general can be quite entertaining. I do quite like Bruffy's content. I'm, I've never much into like his like testing for racing, but some of his, I, I love the random all races. I think they're some of the funniest. Hmm. Where the car changes every lap. See, I don't know how I came across Alex. Uh. I couldn't. There's a lot of these YouTubers. It'll have been. It has been GTA content. It could have been Fails of the Week. Most likely it's GTA, because a lot of the stuff I watch now... Like I say, I watch the on it because of GTA. Yeah. I've now finished watching them again, but that's... I did. I no. never officially, no, no. I just thought... No, no. Uh, it was Minecraft for me, with Achievement oh, no. Honor. It was, it was GTA. No, it, it was... Yeah. First for me it was Minecraft, then it was the GTA stuff. I went the other way, I was looking for, it was just after GTA 5 launched. Yeah, but... And I was looking for stuff on that, and then, and then later on I went back through like Minecraft and... Because it was, it used to be like the Tower of Pimps and all that. Like, yeah. And, yeah, no, it was yeah. Minecraft for me, but then, like, now, you know, it's... I'll go up and unpack them if you want. Okay. Yeah, it's just... I think the main people I... 
really watches Alex and... And Game Time UK, of course. There are... If you're watching, if you're not subscribed to that, you really should be, folks. There are, like I say, there are other ones, you know, there are others I watch, but... There is another on pack, which would be the other. I know. I'm going to it now. Do we have those containers here, or do we need to pick them up? Uh, no, nah, they're here. Thank God for that. Six yeah. large containers. You're there by the crane. Do you want to? Okay. Well, six la six large and one small. Okay, I think my character got stunned. I should move in. Oh, got stuck for a minute there. I was say, you can just use your... If your character gets stuck, you can just use a reset. Reset. Yeah, I know. Okay. Yeah, now anyway, I jumped down the lift shaft. That worked. <laughs> Whoa. Nothing. I suppose it's one way to get yourself down there. It worked. And you can't say I'm quicker at doing this. I won't say you're quicker, but I think you definitely do a better job than I do. Why? Well, you've probably got a lot more experience with that. you practice with that crane. That's like the concrete as well. Okay, your characters can't swim. <laughs> Let me guess, you basically tried to go into the water That's and you got a Wilhelm scream. I did, yes. And they can they can use that because that's I'm just in public domain. Hence why it appears in some video games. And a lot of people use it in YouTube videos. Yeah. Sounds like a trailer being moved. Like I said, I'm just I'm starting to move some stuff back to our yard, just I think we're getting near the end. Why didn't you back up the alleyway? That's what I'm doing. If I need to get me lined up with the alleyway first. Now you've got to get it out of the alleyway because of the tail swing. Ah, that's easy. Near problem. The yards. Shouldn't be too far from here anyway. Oh, this is around the corner. And. Oh, dear. Because I may have accidentally got one vehicle stuck, but I'll fix it later. What have you got stuck? I. I have this habit of opening the ramps on the truck and getting out too soon. So the ramps are only like half. And I tried to drive the service truck off the back with the ramps half out and he's got it all stuck. Ah. You'll probably see when you're back to the yard. How did you get it to the yard? Didn't On the back of a low loader. We have two low loaders, don't forget. Yeah, I know. Oh, you need me to go and have your concrete now, do you? I'm... Oh no, I've got to put the concrete ceiling in. I've got to put the ceiling right. components in. And then after that, it'll be concrete in this bit. And then top floor. Have you actually had a look at the contracts? Not lately, no. To see what's available. I don't mean the main contract. Campaign contracts are meant to main the other. I was gonna have a look once we actually finish this one.
of what you're doing, are you actually storing the vehicles again? Not right now, I'm just taking it back to the yard for now. I thought you might have left the service truck down here, to be honest. I would have done, but he was sort of in the way early on, so... There's still a crane down here. Yeah, I know. Well, that won't fit on the low loads as well, he's have to drive no. that. Okay, that's annoying. You wouldn't like farm, so I can't. I'm trying to like use the digger to help free this stuck truck, and it won't. Yeah, no, you might have to just. That's just starving, but. Just reset. Do a vehicle reset on when you're in the service truck, and it should reset it. I had to, yeah. Rather than just sticking it in storage. It is going to want us to follow the concrete. This bit before the top section. Yeah, well, I'll be there once you're ready. Yeah, everything's been put nicely parked up. Apart from the other crane. Apart from the other crane, which I'll bring back in a bit. Then the tower crane will just get dismantled and the uh, other... And then, just, then it's just the cement stuff. Yeah. On the telehandler. Telehandler, you could probably take back, but no, I think no. you're. I'm actually thinking that can be probably get installed. Well, I don't think we're going to use it. We right? need concrete. Yeah. I'm actually thinking of selling the telehandler. Yeah, because it's pretty shite. Pretty shite. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the same way that the ocean's pretty wet. Some of it, sometimes it can be all right. The telehandler depends on what you're using it for, but you've got to be, they're not. In this game, oh, that's me selling the telehandler. You've got to be accurate with it. Yeah. And that's... Farm Sims can have its moments, but I seem to think it was better than that one. Farm Sim has a better model of... Yeah. ...how the telehandlers work. The telehandlers in this game work more like how a forklift does, which is the wrong... Mm. ...which is the wrong way to do it. If I'm honest. Yeah. Telehandler should work how a telehandler is supposed to work. Mm. Not. I know technically a telehandler you could class it like a forklift, but they're not technically a forklift. Or are they a forklift? Um, it's, it's a kind of forklift. It's like a forklift on steroids, isn't it? Yeah. Why does that sound like something a question you'd ask while incredibly high? Is mm. a telehandler a type of forklift? No, but... I don't know about you, but I'm looking at this hotel. Unless they're going to build something else off the back there, I wouldn't like to walk out one of them back doors. I that blue one you're directly above now. Yeah, I think they're uh, they're just more windows. <laughs> From here it looks like a door. <laughs> Watch that first step, it's a bit extreme. Mm. <laughs> but I technically, yeah, I think they're more just something. 
Do we need to move to the other one? I'm just curious. I don't think I've got, I really don't think I've got the reach. I don't, I really don't think you have. You were able to get like the edge, but you're not be able to get all of it. Yeah, no, I've got no reach on that. And then, once we've done this... We shouldn't have a huge amount more left to do. I think it's a couple of players, is it just placing some bits? Nice. Get out of the camera mode, dickhead. <laughs> Yeah, I'd say the windows. But they look they do look like doors, I can see where you're actually coming from there. They do, don't well, they? They look, it look like the exact same. If you look doors. at the, the other side of the containers look exactly the same as opposed to the sliding doors. Yeah, you definitely have balconies, but when you look closer they look like windows. <laughs> yeah, there's only gonna be the top floor to do, is there? I think so, yeah. Like I tell you in the job. I don't think there's no, I hope there's not another floor. I think this is, the, well, this is the top floor by the looks of it, but. Yeah. What? Uh, let me check out. Jobs. There's top floor, special components, special yeah. delivery. And then debrave. There's like another, Eight large containers and one small one. For the top floor? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Don't sound too enthusiastic like. Yeah, I'm just wondering how it's going to all go, but I think I know. I think. I mean, ideally you could put it across the top. <laughs> Machine's empty. Any worries? Power on again. Yep, I can hear it. That's a good thing. Sometimes like, you can hear when the person's powering again. Yeah. That should be technically it for... This should be it for concrete in. So technically they these can go back, but there's no point taking yeah. it back till till we sort of head to the yard. Yeah. There you go. Oh for fuck's sake. Some more construction material to be unpacked. Yep. Are you clear with that truck? No you're not. Not quite. You having difficulties? No, no, no. Just getting everything shut down. Just cancel it. I know I, I hadn't actually hit it unlike somebody. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Is it this floor? Oh, come on, don't. Piece of. Thanks, game. What have we done? Got caught in the stairwell. I got caught in the stairwell, so I'm now going to run back up the bloody stairs again. There has a moment if you end up getting to a certain point and. Pinches. Bit of a pinch point. Yeah. This one. Yeah. There's a bit of the top floor. I mean, it looks alright with a metal grating that they've put here. I mean, it looks rather industrial to me. It looks. Hey, I'm not sure if it's one of a hotel. Yeah, but. The Amsterdam, what they do in Amsterdam. There's a. What are they Amsterdam? There's a. An Airbnb that they put under the special category. It's like one of the, It's like an old. Um, 
Yeah. Harbour Corrin. Right. You can rent. You on the Corrin? Mm. Nah, no, God, you're a lot better than me. So it's like a, you know, like a big harbour grin. You can actually rent it yeah. out. But the special thing about the crane is, is you can actually ro. There's no crane on it anymore, but you can rotate the crane. Right. Okay, that's interesting. So though, basically, you can wake up. For example, you can have the 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 crane position so you say watch the sunrise mm. come up then if you want to watch the sunset or whatever if you're in you can basically yeah. move the crane to face that way oh very nice well have you actually stopped in here or have you just know no about it? i just know about it i i looked through the i was curious because i wanted to see what was what and in the airbnb mm. like special character category there's somebody's actually God knows how they've done it. I guess they've had permission to, to do so. You can. There's mm. some genius has actually done Shrek's swamp. Oh, Aye. <laughs> so I'm guessing obviously they'll have had permission because otherwise they would have seriously had a cease and desist. Because <laughs> obviously they're. You know, they're doing. Uh, property, yeah. uh, an IP, aren't they? So, oh yeah, I've seen it. It looks, looks interesting. There are some good specials. Yeah, in this, well, the class them is oh my god category because mm -hmm. some are just like yeah, <laughs> fantastic. I mean, they're expensive. Some of them. I mean, the Amsterdam crane wasn't that expensive. It's no more expensive than probably what I pay for. The standard Airbnb. The one that I usually go to when I'm in uh, Valve. Yeah. So. I really want to get back this year, but that's not going to happen now. <laughs> There's a temptation. <laughs> if I ever got. If I ever did get a mobility car. Fucking. Drive out there. Drive out there. Take yeah. the car over, but the only problem is I'd have to do the boat, and I really don't want to do the boat. I could do the tunnel, I suppose. But that means I'd have to go through fucking France. <laughs> <laughs> and if it's to believed, the fucking French thing is full of toll roads. Aye. I don't want to do France. There will become at some point in May, but obviously Tim's not going to be around for yeah a week because he's buggering off to Italy. Oh, very nice. Yeah, he's going to. Uh... It's only it'd be only the Tuesday, like a Tuesday and a Thursday for one week. He's going to do Italy. I think they're going Venice and. He did say where else. So I know I know he said Venice was one. I guess he's taking Beth, he's not going by himself. No. Beth's good. <laughs> oh very nice. nice. Kind of uh, I think they're going I think they're doing Venice. It's, doing it's a shame Rome. you kinda of got yourself out there for a couple of days, isn't it? Yeah. I'm guessing we do have to go and pick up this large container. Off you go, David. Um I'm guessing well, if I well, if I take the crane, do you want to jump into one of the flatbeds back of the yard and bring it across? Yeah. Where are we picking it up from? I'm going to guess it's going to be the metal workplace where we always pick these things up. I can't fucking see it. Yes. Oh, we have a mobile crane over there. We have the sunny over there. Yeah, we already have it over. But there's just a light. There's a blue outline come up on the floor where they normally spawn. Which one's um, there's no, no crane here. There's oh no... yeah, there is. It's here. I was going to say, there should be the crane there. We left it there. That needs to come back. No, the to crane there. I mean, there, were, there is actually a container here. It says hotel on the side of it in big letters. I don't want to be marked there. I want to be marked there. You know what? Both the trucks are out. You'll just, you just need to jump in one. Yeah, I'm 
actually just going to bring this back over and fast travel for now. I thought we had a crane still here and we've left it. Yeah, we do. Because I said, we might as well leave it for in case we need it. in on it. Yeah. Funk it on. Alright, do you wanna Are you driving that back to No because we don't need we've got the other one. Oh do you want why don't we just we've got two of these crates, why don't we leave this here? Because it gets repaired. Otherwise It's got hardly any damage on it anyway. Yeah but it might need be needed somewhere else. Yeah but we can deal with that when we I can take it back if you want, there's no problem to me. You might as well just take it back and store it. I only brought it out uh, and left it there because I knew we were going to need it at some point. I'm not sticking to traffic rules here, guys. I'm. <laughs> really? Moving. Whatever made you think that? I could have just fast forwarded this, but I'm moving it forward. Well, I'll tell you what, in theory of you, you can't see a great deal. What, on the crane? You hear a wacky great crane to attach the cab right in front of you. How do you think drivers feel in real life? Hmm. Which, uh... Which hand driver is that? <laughs> it's a left hooker. Most cranes are, though, aren't they? I think more... I think it's because it's one of them things they don't build up to Ukraine markets, so they just left on drive. Hmm. Must admit, I've never seen one like this in England with a Scania cab on it. No, you don't see... You don't see many of them. Most of the things you see around here are like Libyas and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, they are. Sunny's probably more... Hmm. European market. I think I've mentioned before, do you know Leap here made fridges? Yeah. Like household, literally household fridges? Yeah. I'm like, I really now want to Leap here fridge. Just because of... <laughs> You've been paying for the fucking roof, probably. Probably, but you know what I mean? Branded. Probably what my expensive than a Smeg one is. A what? you never seen Smeg brand stuff? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now, as a Red Dwarf fan, I'd love, like, a Smeg fridge or someone, but they're such silly money. Yeah, but the problem is... It's a shame that they never got... They never got that... Copyrighted. They never got that word, copyrighted. <laughs> I'd also need to know a lot more Chrome Less to write the word head across the bottom of it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, even better, I don't know, it's heat. <laughs> I'm surprised you've not messed around with my... No, you've not, not really been on the stream. Alan, the other day when we were doing Enshrouded, had great fun using some of his points. <laughs> Sorry, I've just not... I try and catch themes where I can, but you know what it's like. Yeah, Alan had over 18,000... Yeah. I've been trying to get stuff recorded and at the same time I'm also trying to I've set myself a challenge now before F124 launches I actually want to complete at least one season of 23 oh a young season you see I haven't so I'm, that's my mission is to try and get that done so I mean, I'm trying to fit depends in get if, a few yeah, but it depends if you're even going to buy the new game Oh, I, you know I am. I hate myself for saying you know I am. I'm. That's a problem. I'm really on an R and. And believe me, I've almost convinced myself of the championship edition. That's how bad it is. Because, like I say, I know using shop two, I can get that down to about seventy-two quid. Yeah, but it's not a lot. Like I say, I'm very on an R in all the. I know I'll end up buying it. How far are you off base? I'm just going into the yard now. 
Do you want to jump into the truck down here so you can see this bit when you've parked that up or stored it or whatever? Here, yeah, one second. Well, that truck's at like 42%. That truck needs a service. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> I'm here. So now it wants us to clear the construction site. Yep. No, they don't need moving, it's just the you need a big crane down the side. And this. Yeah, the crane's on the construction site. Where's the dude? He's around the other side, apparently. Fucking would be, wouldn't he? He's here. No. There you go. Forty foot hotel. Yeah. It's completed. Doesn't right. Best thing you can do, rather than drive all them back, just store them, store all the vehicles. Right. No, I was right. There were windows this side. Um, they probably were windows, but they just. Yeah, that needs. 